Hey, what up guys, it's Grim, and previously on Dragon Warrior 3, uh, we got the Thieves' Key, and we got a magic ball from an old man. So now, we need to figure out what the F we are doing with this magic ball thing, you know? So, uh, luckily I know beforehand, uh, we have to go eastward on the continent of Alihan, I guess? Magicians! Hate these guys. But, yeah, we're gonna head out east and explore the rest of this island. It's a very small island. Um, I think this map of, uh, the Dragon Warrior 3 universe is... As I was saying, I think the map of the Dragon Warrior 3 world... Yeah, this map of Dragon Warrior 3 is kind of, uh, like, the actual world, and I believe Alihan is, uh, Australia, I think. Oh, it's another old man, what do you know? Hehe, <laughs> oh, young man, do you have the magic ball? I do. You must go to the Cave of Enticement, you will find it near spring. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, that's for the, uh, new blitz for this game. I guess you talk to that guy and you figure out what you're supposed to do. I already knew what to do, so... We're gonna go this way. And, oh man, if there is any more old men I gotta deal with on this mission, I am going to rage. What the shit? This is the cave of adjustment! But the stairway is sealed off by a stone wall! Well, that other old man, I'm guessing your brother, uh, told me to use a magic ball on it. Let's check this out. Grimly sets up the magic ball. Whoa! Intense NES graphics! This blew the shit out of that wall. And down we go. Ugh. Now, this is a freaking maze. I'm gonna be lucky. Yeah, I'm gonna be lucky to find my way around here. Uh, I, th I cannot remember where to go at all in this place. Uh, normally I would have tried mapping it out beforehand, but I wanted to show you the uh, explosion with the old band magic ball thing. Oh, this is a lovely fight we have here. Demon anteaters kind of suck. Let's try one of our spells. Expel. On the mask mob. I really hope that works. It'd be spectacular if it did. If they cast surround on me, it is not going to be a pleasant battle. And the demon anteaters. You thought anteaters were bad. Oh, these are demon anteaters. Booge, booge. Oh, it didn't work. Oh well, that's cool. Got rid of one of them. Yeah, the expel spell. Uh, you can use it just to get rid of guys. You don't get, like, gold or experience when you use it. It just makes them go away. Uh, it's pretty much what running should be. Oh. More demon anteaters. Now, I was wondering, if I were an ant, I'd be really scared of these guys. But why are anteaters attacking people? You know? I mean, I'm gonna understand the demon anteaters doing it, but normal anteaters? That's just ridiculous. Waylon, still taking a break. Freaking goof-offs. Continuing our journey. We went the wrong way. I'm gonna go down here and see what happens. Oh, I don't like this one bit. Okay, I don't know if I was supposed to do that, but let's go up these stairs. Great, I'm back where I started. God. God. <laughs> I'm painfully lost. Okay, continuing right along. Oh, this feels right. Wow, they are not going to let us through this cave. Oh my god. I just went in a circle. <laughs> I hate this dungeon. Oh, these are spiked hairs. Um, they're rabbits with horns. But not just that. Uh, I think they either cast sleep or a 
occasionally when they attack you, it puts you to sleep. It can be very, very annoying. Especially when you have a super high encounter rate and you're in a dungeon where you don't know where to go. Let's try this way. A chest! We search chests. And we find the antidote herb. Okay, that would have been nice last episode when I didn't have any. Yeah, this game can be pretty crappy if you don't have an, a way to cure poisons. It's not just, you know, you take damage every time you take a few steps from the poison. It's more like the screen going red over and over again in your face. It's not pleasant. It gets kind of annoying after a while. So, you want to stock up on your antidote herbs. It's the smart thing to do. Okay, this feels right. I am not going to stop and ask for directions. I think it's this way. It must be. Yes, because stopping and asking for directions is synonymous with giving up. Oh, here we go. There's some stairs. Okay, I think we made it somewhere. Yes, this looks like something for sure. Oh, I hope you guys don't mind me editing out most of these fights. Uh... Yeah, these are the two guys that are really a concern to me in this place. Is a demon anteater <laughs> coiling, breaking out in a smile. Uh, yeah, the spike tears and the demon anteaters, they're the heavy hitters of this place. But I'm kind of overleveled for it, so it's not a problem. I mean, if you want me to not edit out so many fights, you know. Uh, yeah, if you don't want me to edit out so many fights, you know, just leave a comment below. You know, get a hold of me, and I will do what I can. You know, I have a strong feeling you guys wouldn't want to see all these fights. Ooh, what's that thing? Yep, I'm going to have to do a lot of editing in this episode. Oh, oh my god, what's going on? The screen, it's getting all weird. I must have stepped on a weird tile or something. What happened? I'll tell you what happened. That is what we call a travel door. I believe it was first introduced in Dragon Warrior 2. But anyway, it's like a teleportation sort of dilly. Takes you from one place to another. Like this place. What is this place? This is, um... Well, let's find out. Hey, buddy. What is this place? This is Romilly! Wow, new town, new continent, all sorts of new crap going on. And we will check it out next time on Dragon Warrior 3. I'll check you guys later.